I'm all in on Strowman. I started following him on Twitter, and I love his attitude. I mean, he's even got a clothing line that I'm a fan of that. He's a very positive guy. And look, he's had success at the big league level in a very difficult division in the American League East with the Blue Jays. So I think I'm not going to say he's going to win a Cy Young. I do think he could pitch to the low threes, maybe even high twos in a great year and be a legit number two starter. Forget the numbers. I don't really want to put numbers on it. I truly believe Marcus Stroman will be a legit number two in this rotation behind Jacob deGrom this year. I think you throw out what happened last year, obviously opting out, even the year before getting acclimated from the trade. So I think Stroman can be and will be a legit number two. I think you just want free sweatshirts. <laughs> I already paid the box it, coming tomorrow from Stroman. <laughs> uh, look, I want, I'll take this opportunity to compliment Jeremy Hefner for believing in his guys, uh, for working hard to help them maximize their potential, and for, for talking them up in the media, which is part of his job. And I would also like a box of clothes, if, if that would be possible. There you go. I mean, yeah, everybody would like a box of clothes. Why not? Marcus, SNY, box of clothes. Just send a whole bunch of stuff here. But look, yeah, I, I think this guy can be very good. I think he could be a two or three. Uh, you know, again, I hate putting numbers on it, but that's just how we talk about it. So, uh, you know, I, I think he has the potential to be really good. I, I wouldn't quite say Cy Young Award winner. Uh, but look, you know, Jeremy Hefter's doing his job. He's the pitching coach, and, and he's treating Marcus Stroman kind of like that boxer. I think he tweeted something about that today, Sal, uh, you know, who needs some of that encouragement and just wants to hear those things all the time.